Hi everybody, I thought I'd start doing some naturalist videos. So um, I'm going to bring you an animal and kind of tell you a little bit about them. Uh, today I have brought an iconic animal from my childhood, the fig eater beetle. This is Cotinus mutabilis. It's a beautiful little beetle. Um, it's a member of the scarab family. And uh, a lot of scarab beetles are known for their kind of iridescent um, color and uh, and also for their thick shells, which are their primary mode of defense. And you'll notice that I'm holding him, which I'm not going to hold all the insects that I show you because some of them bite or sting, but these guys are totally harmless. Um, you'll see that he's got a bunch of little hooks on the end of his legs. Uh, those are for gripping, and he also has a little shovel nose and that kind of gives you a clue as to what he eats, which is just rotting fruit. He'll kind of dig that shovel nose in there and scoop it on out and eat it. Um, they are uh, pretty common in Southern California. Um, they have two sets of wings, like all beetles. So the, they have the flying wings, which you don't see here, and then they have these little cover wings that pretty much protect their, their flying wings, which are a lot more delicate. Um, they, uh, because they eat fermented fruit a lot of the time, it's suspected that that is why the most common way to see these guys is them accidentally flying at you. Uh, they are trashed all the time. So um, they're very clumsy and uh, I find them really charming because they're just cute little weirdos. And uh, these are guys who will bump into your windows and you know, land on you when you don't want them to. But other than that, they are kind of valuable to the environment because they do eat things that are rotting, which takes away a lot of the mess. They are considered pests in our monoculture, but um, that's pretty much the case across the board with monocultures is when you have a lot of just one crop that you're growing, one insect will flourish there like crazy and they become pests. But uh, overall, these guys are pretty useful, and uh, I recommend uh, making one your friend. So uh, I'm going to let this guy go, and um, I hope you enjoyed this little segment. Alright, there you go, buddy. Okay, anytime now. Anytime. I'm going to show off those wings. There you go. Bye.